Hello and welcome back to the final episode of Fighting Against Green Earth. After this, we'll be finally fighting the final foes. And once again, completely different maps depending on who you pick, and I'm going to be picking Andy because he's got a really unique and fun map. We're almost done the game, mission 18 of 22. Now, it's in the most obvious spot, which is the hardest reef to get to, this one. This is all around a pretty easy map because he doesn't have many indirect units. So what we're gonna do is we just want to block off points where he could come from. And we're gonna be moving straight down here, and we have to just make sure it's safe. All around, pretty easy map, really. Just block up choke points like here, here, and here, and you should be good. Also, we want to have units moving in on the ground, because what we want to do is get a tank right here, so that we can shoot right here with our battleship. Really simple, but really fun stage. And as for the rest of the units, uh... As for the rest of these units, I never found a use for them. I think I can do this stage in maybe eight days. I think that was supposed to be a hint at which one it was in, but it's pretty obvious he's in the farthest away one. And I guess it's all safe down here. I'll just clog that up. Just in case. Also, might as well do a little bit of damage here while we can. And the leftover lander can be here to just help plug, it, plug up all the places they could come from. Now... Where can he... he can reach basically everywhere but right where my guy is. I want him to attack, I'll lead him in using Andy there. As long as he doesn't attack from above, which he cannot do, I'll be able to hit him. This is good. Perfect. I've let him in. He won't be able to see me in the reef there, so I can hit him with the cruiser, move in with the sub. Assuming the sub stays there, he'll probably move forward, so... Oops, uh, I actually meant to attack the tank. Okay, well that's not a huge game-changing problem. Okay, all I care about is getting over here, so I'll keep moving. Also, it looks like it's safe down there, so I'll bring this sub up in case I need a spare. And you can just stay parked right there, because that's enough to reach the reef. Eh, yeah, not really a big loss losing that lander.
Okay, we've got all that under control. Might as well do some damage down there while I can. And... Sink his cruiser so he's got less vision. Uh, I don't really have any way of fighting that cruiser. So I'm just going to waste as much of his time as possible. I did a little bit better in practice on that North Island. That tank was in great condition. Now, how do I want to tackle this? Well, of course I want to hit that. And I want to heal up. Especially after that tsunami, which makes Andy actually a good person to fight him. And by doing that, he's lost vision. I might as well keep him there. He's going to get hit, probably, but... Not a huge deal. If I were to move him, he'd still be hit, so... In fact, where can you hit? There? Okay. You can stay in position. We're almost ready to get vision, and it'll take two turns of shooting with the battleship. Really? That's what you do with your turn? Okay. I'm gonna move him aside, raise him out of the water. And you can reach them if you want to, but I don't know if you can see them. Uh... Good luck now, asshole! There we go. And starting next turn, we'll start the assault, which means we will beat him on day 8, unless something unexpected happens. No, he's just gonna sit there? Okay. Fine with me. There's his lander, start attacking. So we killed innocent lives instead of simply talking to you. Alright, we're finally done fighting with the other innocent countries of the world, and of course... S rank on that. I did great. I didn't think I was gonna get so much power, but okay. I tend to undershoot when I guess these ranks. Which I guess is better than overshooting. Overshooting would be more embarrassing. Oh, we're going back to Blue Moon a little bit. Alright, looks like we're fighting someone new. So on the next episode, that would be episode 19? Hmm, was this episode 19? Was this 18? Hmm. I think the next episode is 19. And then that means 20, 21, and 22, which would be the final three episodes, which would be voting week. Alright, thank you everybody for watching, and until next time, have a nice day.